Good morning children. So children, today I am going to take your model science class. Right? So which chapter do you remember? In the last class we learnt? Yes, very good. Which lesson? Lesson 2, our world. Our world. What did you learn in that class? You learnt about God's creation. Isn't it? God has created wonderful place where we live with lots of trees, beautiful flowers, rivers, mountains, fish. Isn't it? So, so many beautiful things is there already in our world. So, today we will do the exercises related with the same lesson. Okay? So, all of you open your page number 7. Can you see here? A question is given. Make a small prayer to thank God for giving us this wonderful world. So, we have to write a small prayer. To thank whom? To thank God who has given us such a wonderful world where we live. So, shall I? I am going to write here. You have to note it down. Okay? So, here we have to thank whom? God. So, I am starting. Thank you God. Thank you God. For this Wonderful world Thank you God For everything So children, you have to write this small prayer. Okay? Thank you God for this wonderful world. You are thanking God for this wonderful world. Thank you God for everything. We are thanking God for everything God has given us. Okay? Okay, now turn your page. Now children, fill in the blanks. A. The dash is a beautiful place to live in. Now where we are living children? In this beautiful earth, isn't it? So, what is beautiful? Our world is beautiful. So, answer will be the world. Okay? Now next one. The sky is full of twinkling dash. What can you see? In the sky, children at night, you can see there's something twinkling, isn't it? What is twinkling? Very good. Answer is stars. The next one. Flowering dash. Now what blooms, children? Very good plants, flowering plants. And... Fruit dash. Now what gives you fruit? Fruit trees are home to colorful birds and insects. Isn't it? So flowering plants and fruit trees. These are the two words that you have to write in C are the home to Beautiful insects and birds. Colorful insects and birds. Okay. Now next one. D. Dash dance in the blue waters. What dance in the blue waters children? 
You learnt it in the last class. Very good. Fish. Fish dance in the blue waters. Okay. So, first one. The world is a beautiful place to live in. Second one. The sky is full of twinkling stars. Third one. Flowering plants and fruit trees are home to colorful birds and insects. Now, next one. Fish dance in the blue waters. Okay? Okay. Now, we will do the next one. Answer the following. And first question. Where do we live? Where do we live? So, children, what will be the answer? We live in this beautiful world. Isn't it? We are living in this beautiful world. So, first answer, all of you write. We live in this beautiful world. Okay? So, where do we live children? We live in this beautiful world. Okay? Now the next question. What do we see in the sky at night? Children at night, what do you see in the sky? You can see the stars. Then what else you can see? Very good. Moon. So, children write the answer. We can see the stars and the shining moon at night. Children, what do we see in the sky at night? We can see the stars and the shining moon at night. Isn't it? So, what do we see in the sky at night, children? We can see the stars and the shining moon at night. Okay? Now, the third question. Now, children, third question. When does the moon appear? So, when do you see the moon, children? Yes, you see the moon at night. So, the answer will be The moon appears at night. So children, when does the moon appear? The moon appears at night. The moon appears at night. Okay. Now the next question. What do you see in the blue waters? In the last class, I taught you. What do you see in the blue waters? Big and small fishes dancing. Isn't it? So write the answer. We can see big and small fishes dancing in the Blue waters. Now once again children. 
What do you see in the blue waters? We can see big and small fishes dancing in the blue waters. Okay? Now children, come to your next page. This is page number 9. Now, color the pictures of the beautiful world given below. Can you see here? First one is sea. Second one is mountain. Third one river. Fourth one valley. Next garden. And the last one desert. So children, you will take your crayons and color it very nicely. Look here. Look at the beautiful picture. You can see the beautiful world. Isn't it? Now children, you all have to watch the beautiful video of our world. Okay? Just watch it. wonderful world God has given us. Isn't it? So children, all of you will read the lesson and learn all the exercise, exercises that I have given. Okay? And you have to write in your textbook. Okay? You have to write that in your textbook and also you will color page number 9 in your textbook. Okay? Okay, children, have a great day. Thank you.